Hello guys, and DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time we have South City Duelist versus PSA Trader, and this is going to be some Edison format matches, it's going to be $10 a match, so the winner's going to win $10 per match, and the loser's going to lose $10, and yeah, also make sure to go ahead and check out the Coliseum Discord link down below at the very top of the description, if you want to play old format for money, current format for money, any format for money, uh, or in tournaments or anything like that. Then we're going to see PSA, Trader, win the Rock, Paper, Scissors, Shoot, and decide to go first, 40 versus 40. Gotta love to see it. Opening hands, we got Mind Control, Heavy Storm, Gold Sark, Trap, Dust, Shoot, Stratos. They got Gold Sark, Lila, uh, Christia, Soul of Purity and Light, Called Haunted, and then Celestia. Okay, and you see right there, good luck. Hi, friend, $10 a match. Okay, so we are in Edison format, and we got Light Sworn going up against, can't really tell you, uh, but they're going to activate Gold Sark, Banish Charge, and then Normal Summon Lila, Set Call the Haunted, End Phase Mill 3, Pass, they draw Miracle Fusion, and then activate Heavy Storm just to MST, they call the Haunted. The Gold Sark isn't actually in the Spell and Trap Zone, they're just leaving it there to make it easy to remember about Charge. Uh, Normal Summon Stratos, Effect. And then they're going to go ahead and grab out uh, e Evil Hero, Infernal Prodigy from the decks of the hand, which most likely means that they play like Monarchs in their deck. Uh, they're going to attack over, activate Gold Sark, Banish Diva, and then Set Trap, Dust Shoot, Pass. They draw Honest. That's such a good card. Uh, Honest, Kalu. Like, those cards are nice. Activate Trap, Dust Shoot, look at their hand, and then put back a card. They're going to put back the Soul Impurity. Okay, so Christia won't be live for so long. Celestial isn't live. Honest isn't live without these two being live. So they're just on zero cards is what I'm seeing. So we're going to get a little bit of time to get some damage in. Draw Plague. Battle Phase. Attack for 18. And then Pass. Draw Lila. Okay, well, grab back Charge. And now they can go Charge to grab Lumina. Uh, charge and Lumina, we're both at one in this format. Both those cards are so good. Especially Charge, Milk Card Trooper, um, Arcura, Celestia, and then Search Lumina, Summon Lumina, Effect, Discard Celestia, bring out the Arcus, and then Battle Phase, Arcus Attack, Drop Honest. Uh, that actually puts four fairies in Graveyard too, wow. That's why they did that, that makes sense. And then Attack, Main Phase 2, Summon out Christia, Christia Effect, Add Back Honest. And then that just puts, like, tremendous pressure on the opponent. And early game, Christia like this low. Uh, most boss monsters early game are pretty easy to deal with. Uh, but it's fine, because we got the add back Honest anyways. And then they're going to Gold Sark, grab Diva. And then set Plague, pass, they draw Raikou. Okay. Um, Christia, attack. And then we're going to attack for 22. Which is fair enough. And then they're going to set Raikou. End phase mill. And the Raikou set there is really good too. Uh, Milling Plague's good. They draw Gilman. Not good. Mind control to take Raikou. You can't Arcus stop that. It's actually crazy that this mind control is why they're able to out this. I was going to say, usually like decks just have some spy removal in their deck and they're eventually able to get to it to out Christia or some trap cards. Uh, I guess Caius isn't really in out because it's kind of hard to get there. Uh, that's going to go to the top of their deck. We actually milk Caius, Judgment, and Brain Control. And then we're going to go Normal Summon, Diva, Diva Effect, bring out from the deck, bring out Diva. Okay, so what we're going to go Synchro 4 into Synchro 6, make Armory Arm. Activate Miracle Fusion, Banish, Banish, bring out Absolute Zero. And then we're going to go Armory Arm, Diva, and the Goyo. Uh, battle Phase, Goyo, Attack, Drop Honest, okay. And then we get the Attack over the Lumina. Okay, I'll say that worked out fairly well for us. They draw Christia that we knew that they were going to draw. So, you know, they put it on the top of their own deck. They got way too many fairies though now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wait, really? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, well, they're one soul and purity away from having a really good turn. Okay, and so they hit another fairy. Cool, pass, draw Mally. And then normal summon Gilman, battle phase tack over, Gilman tack directly for 17. Pass, draw orange light, and then, well, you could 
Oh, wait, you can't even summon Lila. I guess you could summon Lila and crash. It also helps the absolute zero be dropped down and attack, but then they probably just end the game. But we draw Rhoda. Uh, we're going to activate Rhoda, grab Greffer. Maybe they think, oh, I need to use a monster effect to go for game. And then they hit you with Orange Light into a top deck JD. Dark Greffer, discard Mally, dump Sangan. Mally goes summon, they scoop. They could have Orange Lighted the Dark Greffer though, right? Or did they... I think that they had Plague in Graveyard though. Oh, uh, we got Caius, the Shadow Monarch, Plague, Caius, Torrential, Smashing Ground. They have Solar Recharge, Judgment Dragon, Royal Decree, Raikou, Call the Haunted, and then draw Solar Recharge. Uh, Smashing Ground's good to out big bodies. So they're going to go Solar Recharge, discard Raikou, draw Shire, and Lila, and the discard, or the Mill Thunder King, and Gold Sark. Activate Solar Recharge, discard Shire, draw Celestial. And Soul Impurity, and then Mill, Royal Oppression, and Celestia. Normal Summon, Lila, Set 2, and Phase Mill 3. That was a really good turn 1, getting the Mill just a bunch of cards. I mean, we already have 4 Light Swords in Graveyard. Like, our JD's turned on turn 1. We got Decree for back row. Call the Haunted to bring back out, like, a Thunder King if we need to. Draw Mind Control. Mind Control, try to, try to take effect to try to pop a back row. Pop Decree. Normal Summon out Plague. Activate called. Oh, I guess you can also just call the haunted out Christia. Yeah, that's not bad. It's definitely not bad. It's just kind of awkward when you don't have anything else set up. Um, it's still just a big body though. It'll get you turns at the minimum. But yeah, they're gonna go ahead and smashing ground one for one trade with that. Uh, they don't have. Yeah, they only have two fairies and gravers. So the Christia will not be live for the time being. But we are gonna make a go yo guardian and then attack. Okay, set torrential pass. They draw Christio for turn. And then special summon out JD. Uh, JD effect with priority. Chain torrential. And then they're going to go summon out soul. Banish two. Attack. Wow. Okay. Oh, we choose to banish Thunder King instead of Arcus. I mean, that's actually pretty obvious, right? Whoa. I guess maybe it's not. But okay, pass. Draw card trooper. Uh, bring back Plague, put back Monarch, bring out Monarch to banish, attack, dropping them down to 18, pass for Royal Decree, they admit defeat, okay, so now South City Duelist is up $10, and then they win the Rock Paper Scissors shoot in the next match, so opening hands, we got Card Trooper, Torrential, Evil Hero, Prodigy, Brain Control, Miracle Fusion, Rota, they have Raikou, Honest, Call the Haunted, Christia, and Celestia, so activate Rota, go grab Stratos, and then normal summon out card trooper mill three mills a uh, trigodia pass they draw solar recharge and then they're gonna activate it discard draw gold sark orange light mills two lights for names two activate gold sark uh gold sark banish jd and then set raiko set call the haunted pass draw evil hero infernal prodigy activate card trooper mill three mills treeborn Frog and a Penguin Soldier. Let's go, Penguin Soldier. Uh, Treeborn's always a good mill. It's just it's just a plus one every turn that it keeps coming back. It's a very minor plus one, but if you draw it, like you draw tribute monsters with it, it helps out a lot too for free value. Uh, Stratos attack Raikou. Raikou pop Stratos. Mill three. And it actually hits two fairies there, so now they have three engraver out of four, and they do have Honest in hand. So that's very easy to get another one in Graveyard. They're going to go Call the Haunted, bring back Christia. They said, okay. And then pass turn, draw Celestia. And then battle phase, tack over, card trooper, draw one, draw on the dark armed. They have one dark in Grave right now. Uh, they draw Gilman. They're going to go Brain Control, take Christia. Okay, tribute it for Mali. And then battle phase. Also, this doesn't go to graveyard. When that monster is destroyed, destroy this card. So that should stay face up on the field. Uh, attack for 800. Pass. Draw charge. Add back JD during standby phase. The turn they draw charge. Holy. Um, yeah, they're one light sworn name away from being able to JD. And they'll probably hit it here. Yep, they mill Shire. Grab Lila. And then summon Lila. Effect try to out the back row before we commit our JD. They're going to Torrential. And then now it's like, is it even worth committing JD if we don't have game? But they actually have one, two, three, four, five fairies in the graveyard. 
So they're just going to summon JD, normal summon Honest, get a very... Well, they already normal summon Lila. Um, okay. Yeah, it looks like they don't catch the double normal summon there, which is very unfortunate. Um, but Enphase, Mill, Pastral Diva, bring back Treeborn, normal summon Diva, Diva effect, and then they're thinking if they want to Orange Light it, Orange Light, Negate and Destroy, activate Miracle Fusion, Banish, summon out Absolute Zero, pass, wait a second, this can't be the right play though, right? Oh, wait, never mind, we know that they have Honest. I was gonna say, don't we switch this to Attack... And then we go attack and crash, and then, yeah, but that's not going to work. And this isn't going to work either, because there's going to go JD pop, normal summon honest game, which honestly shouldn't even be game. I said honestly. Uh, it shouldn't even be game because last turn we double normal summon. So that was just a huge misplay on both players' parts for not catching that. But we're going to see South City Duelist go first game two. We got Return, Light Imprisoning, Caius, Evil Hero, Infernal Prodigy, Diva, Sangan. They have Aaron, Orange Light, Christia, Raiko, Gold Sark. So we're going to set Sangan, Light Imprisoning, they draw Honest. Set Raiko, activate Gold Sark, banish JD. Pass, they draw Diva, flip Sangan, normal Diva, Diva effect, chain Orange Light. Sangan, attack over. We should have normal summon Diva, right? And then flip Sangan. But on the attack of Raiko, activate Light Imprisoning, Mirror. Um. Set return, pass, they draw Cyber Dragon, special Cyber Dragon. Hey, that's a body. Normal summon Aaron. Yeah, okay, just putting up multiple bodies, I guess. Uh, Sangan goes search, grab Fossil Dyna. Okay, that can deal with Cyber Dragon. I don't even know what deck this is. Like, I know this is supposed to be like a Diva Hero deck. It just doesn't even feel like one. It feels like just, there's so many just like random good cards. They don't get the, yeah, they don't get the Mildurin end phase. Um,. Draw Dark Armed. We only have one Dark in the Graveyard right now, but we can very easily fill that up. We're going to Special Summon out the Evil Hero, Tribute Summon for Caius, Banish the Aaron, Attack Cyber Dragon. You may wonder why we're doing it in this order. Um, I think it's because we could Banish Cyber Dragon, Attack Aaron, but the Aaron was normal, so our Fossil Dyna can trade with Cyber Dragon better if we get hit with an Honest or something. Pass, they draw Gold Sark, add back JD. Off the Gold Sark, activate Gold Sark, banish charge, pass, draw future fusion. Then we're gonna go future fusion, go dump, treeborn, stratos. Um, yep. And then the normal summon diva. The opponent of Miss Defeat. So on to the next game now. Game three, we're gonna see PSA Trader go first. And this is to see if PSA Trader can go even right now. We got Evil Hero, Infernal Prodigy, Miracle Fusion, Fossil Dyna, Dark Arm, Torrential. They have Orange Light, Celestia, Arcus, Orange Light, Soul Impurity, and Giant Trinade. Both players definitely opened up weird this game. They mill Lumina there. Uh, pass, they draw Mirror Force. And then Set Torrential, pass, they draw Raikou. Tribute Summon for Celestia, and then we're going to activate Torrential there, but they still get the mill 4. Uh, they don't get the draw. I'm not quite sure why they're drawing. Yeah, lol, sorry. I don't know why. Pass to draw Fossil Dyna. Uh, they're going to go Normal Summon Fossil Dyna. Technically, I mean, they keep messing up these mills and stuff. Honestly, I would force them to show me the top decks and then put it back in the same order because that's what you're supposed to do, and if they called the judge, that's what the judge would rule it. Um... Yeah, because at some point, you know, they might just be maliciously doing this. That way they can see what their mills would be if they were to go for a mill play or not. So I would start be, like, showing me your mills. You know what I mean? You're going to make a mistake. You're going to show me the mills. This is on you. Uh, attack for 12. Set Miracle Fusion. Mirror Force. Pass. I guess set both. It's just, like, that feels like such good value. Like, that's, like, a bait for a Heavy Storm or something. Uh, they draw Soul Impurity. I guess it's to play around Lila on the Mirror Force. Or make them pop Acro too so we can Fossil Dyna attack. Draw Treeborn. Battle Phase. Attack Raikou. Raikou. Pop Fossil Dyna. Mill 3. Main Phase 2. Summon Fossil Dyna. Pass. I draw Royal Decree. Set Royal Decree. Pass. Draw Rota. Rota. Bring out Stratos. Stratos Effect to go search. Chain Orange Light on that to out it. And then attack for 12. End phase, activate Road Decree, pass, I draw Thunder King, and now we can just go like, oh, okay, I guess Giant Trinade, sure, Normal Summon Thunder King, 
Battle phase, attack, set, pass. Um, also don't like how much this looks like Lila in hand. I don't like how much that looks like Lila while it's in hand. Uh, but okay. They're gonna pass, draw MST. They know this sets Royal Decree. They, I mean, they know MST, what it can do to trade with that. They're gonna go Normal Summon Treeborn Frog, activate Miracle Fusion to bring out Absolute Zero. Uh, you can't Thunder King that. Yeah, so they're gonna beat over, set Mirror Force, set MST. I guess it's worth using your Treeborn Frog to trade like that. I was gonna say, you could have also just went for Gaia. Which, like, you have to play it, right? Especially because this deck can go for Goyo so easy with the Diva cards. But they're going to go Royal Decree, End Phase, Pass, they draw Honest. And we're playing Fossil Dino and stuff, so they definitely play it. Uh, summon out Soul, Impurity. And then Battle Phase, Attack, Activate, Honest. And then they're going to Pass, draw Deep Sea Diva, Normal. I mean, like, technically there, when they go Battle Phase, couldn't we have gone Start? Kind of we've just gone like, okay, they're going to go attack, activate Mirror Forest, MST, the World Decree, this goes, because like it's pretty obvious that they're doing an honest play, because why would they ever enter battle phase and attack absolute zero right there? Probably no reason ever. Um, I guess it could be a reason, right? Because they have, what, one, two, three fairies engraved so they're trying to crash this to get the fourth to summon out christia okay okay but honestly if you stop that then absolute zero deals with christia anyways okay um so we're gonna go diva bring out gilman use those make absolute zero imagine go in alley adjust this catastrophe attack um isn't this just more damage though am i wrong 17 plus four or plus six 17 plus six yeah, that's just more damage. So we could have just got 100 more damage if we just attacked with these two instead of using an ally of Justice Catastrophe. Pass, they draw Lila, Normal Summon Lila, Effect Pop Mirror Force, End Phase Mill 3, Pass, draw Monarch, and then we can just go Special, Tribute, Bring Out, Banish, Game. Wait, what? Oh, if you control no monsters. Okay, never mind, 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 never mind. I remembered the card wrong. We're going to go Pastral, Solar Recharge, Set Orange Light, Pastral, Trap Dust Shoot, Tack Over, Set Trap Dust Shoot, Pastral, Road Decree, End Phase, Space Typhoon, Draw Card Trooper, and that's game. All right, so now South City Duelist is up $20, and they're going to do the run back again. We're going to see PSA Trader win the Rock, Paper, Scissors Shoot, go first. We got Kaya's. Penguin Soldier, Mind Control, Spine Gilman, Torrential. They have the Arcus, Orange Light, Solar Recharge, Celestial, uh, Super Nimble, Mega Hamster, and Solar Recharge. So Solar Recharge, Discard, Draw Christia, Beckoning Light, Milk Christia, Charge, Solar, Draw Honest, Raiko, Mill Soul Impurity, and Honest. And then we're going to go Set Raiko, Set Beckoning Light, Pass. Oh, I guess guess this is an okay beckoning light we have enough fairy we have so many fairies actually oh my god yeah this is a good beckoning light pass they draw evil hero they're gonna go normal summon gilman battle phase attack effect pop gilman mills lila another soul impurity there too and then set torrential pass they draw call the haunted set mega hamster call the haunted pass draw heavy storm and then they're going to go main phase, pass, draw gold sark, flip hamster, hamster, bring out Raiko, and then set the Raiko, uh, attack for 11, sure, take it, gold sark for JD, pass, draw MST, pass, draw Aaron, flip, try to pop torrential, chain it, they still mill three, and then they're going to go normal summon Aaron, activate called haunted, bring out Christia, so they're just trying to set up, uh, this is, this is a scary board right here, right? This is already going to force the opponent to do stuff. And then we still have our Beckoning Light live. And it's not like we really want to use it right now. Because we have Honest in hand with Archlord Christia. So, like, we're fine with holding it. Um, maybe mill the other JD, too. Because uh, it's at two in this format. So, maybe mill the other one. Um, also, we milled four there at end phase. We're only supposed to mill three. Unless I'm dumb. Oh, no, we did only mill three. Okay. Uh, we milled Plague, which is good. They draw Card Trooper. So, Heavy Storm, uh, Christio goes to the top, they have one, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven fairies in the graveyard right now. And then South City Duelist honestly just submits defeat there. So going on to the next game, um, we're going to go ahead. We're going to see South City Duelist go first. We got Diva, Caius, Allure, Torrential, Vanity's Fiend. They have Christia, Celestial, Solar Recharge, Ryko, Thunder King. Our sixth draw is Mind Control, Allure, Draw Miracle, Fusion, Mally. Vanish the Caius, Normal Summon Diva, Diva, Bring Out Gilman. And then Set Torrential, Pass. They draw Honest, Activate Solar Recharge, Draw Royal Decree, Judgment Dragon, Mill, Raikou, and Hamster. And then set Raikou, set Decree, pass, draw Light and Prison in Mirror, which if we can get that to go through, we win. Yeah, so we're going to take Raikou, flip Raikou, effect, pop the back row, Mill's Plague and Caius. That Plague there is also crazy. You go in the Armory Arm, Tribute Summon for Vanity's Fiend. Imagine we milled a hero too. Yeah, but tribute summon for Vanity's Fiend. Uh, then we're going to go battle phase, attack, attack, putting them on just the quickest counter uh Put them on like the quickest uh, top deck possible. Like they're only at 38 life points. This is a one turn clock. Uh, they draw MST. And then MST, the Light and Prison Mirror. Normal summon out Thunder King. Battle phase, attack over Armory Arm. They have Honest for Vanity's Fiend. They draw Fossil Dyna. Um, so they, they honestly got hard countered so quick with the Thunder King Honest MST to be able to out everything. Uh, pass, they draw Mega Hamster, attack with 19. I like the play by South City Duelist there, but it just did not work out at all. They draw Judgment, bring out Plague, put back, tribute summon for Mally, activate Torrential there. Mally, banish, bring out Mally, change the top deck, Miracle Fusion, banish, bring out Absolute Zero. We have Judgment to protect this, and we're putting them on the one turn clock again, but this time we have a very, we, we probably have the best protection card here. Um, pass, draw Royal Decree, let's count, one, two fairies. One, two Light Sworn names, and another game lost. So going into game three of match three, we're going to see PSA Trader go first. We got Mirror Force, Allure, Diva, Mali Diva. They have Shire, Celestia, JD, Heavy Storm, Hamster, draw Raikou, set Hamster Pass, they draw Monarch, activate Allure, draw MST, Dark Greffer, banish the Caius, Normal Summon Greffer, effect, discard Mali, dump Plague. Mally banish, bring out Mally. Plague effect, put back MST, bring out. You know if they order it like that, it's because they really want their top deck still. Bring out Stardust Dragon, battle phase, attack, effect, bring out Raikou, attack, effect the pop, chain Stardust. Uh, yep, go ahead. Tribute, negate, destroy, set mirror force, bring back Stardust, pass, they draw orange light. Uh, I guess they could go like Heavy Storm. They chain Stardust, they chain Orange Light, and then they still pop the back row. So that's pretty decent. I mean, it's like three cards for two, but Mirror Forest and Stardust Dragon, I would say, are uh, pretty good. You didn't know it was Mirror Forest, though, but you knew it was Stardust. Uh, especially when the Stardust would trade with Raikou very easily. Uh, draw MST that we knew we were drawing. Summon Diva, Diva, bring out Diva. And then we're going to use those, go into a Goyo Guardian, and then use those, go into Stardust number two. And then start us number two, attack Raikou, trade with Raikou, set MST, bring back, pass. I love it when you see people on two Stardust and it actually comes up. Pass, I draw Royal Oppression, end phase, space it, draw Miracle Fusion. We do have what it takes to go for game. So we're going to Diva, bring out Gilman, activate Miracle Fusion, banish, banish, summon. And then, you know, because it's 600, 17, 25, and then absolute zero, gangs 1,000. So it's 35, 25, 17, uh, 6. So they said, you up 30, got to head out to the locals. Last one, fine. Okay, so South City Duelist is up 30 right now. They've won all three matches, and they just won the Rock, Paper, Scissors shoot for the last match. They're going to go first. Opening hands, we got Brain Control, Dark Refer, Diva, Car Trooper, MST. Draw on the Gores. Oh, uh, finally. We finally are seeing Gores in this. Um, they got Lila, Card Troopers, Soul and Purity and Light. Aaron and Beckoning Light. Summon Card Trooper, Mill 3. Mill Plague, Infernity Prodigy. Pass. They draw Gold Sark. They're going to go Card Trooper, Mill 3. Battle Phase, 
crap. Well, I guess not crash beat over right yet because they're not getting an attack right now. They draw one. Gold Sark, Banish Solar Recharge, Set Beckoning Light, Draw Return, MST the set card, Chain Beckoning Light. Uh, they're going to discard three, add back Orange Light, Honest, and Lila. Yeah, you can't really afford to add back JD there if you want to add back Orange Light. So, uh, not too sure why you actually grab Orange Light. Summon Diva. Diva effect, bring out Spawn Gilman. I guess, like, the orange light will be decent enough soon. Gilman beat over, draw on the hamster, and then take damage from Diva. Go on the ally, Justice Cataster, pass, they draw Gold Sark. Set hamster, Gold Sark onto JD, pass, they draw Mally. And then summon Dark Greffer, special it by discarding Mally. Uh, Greffer, banish, I mean, Mally, banish, bring out Mally. And then they're gonna use Plague effect. So Plague's gonna put back Gores, bring out Plague. Um, not game with Brio. We're gonna go for Dark End Dragon effect. Go ahead, send the set. They're gonna chain Orange Light on it. I mean, we knew it wasn't game anyways, right? Well, we didn't know for sure. Um, but they probably kept the Orange Light and the Honest in hand there. Now yeah, Justice, Cataster, Attack, and the Hamster, set Raiko, and then we're gonna go Dark Greffer, Attack, Effect, Pop Synchro, Mill 3, and then set Return, Pass, draw Raiko, Solar Recharge comes back to hand, and then we can activate that, discard Raiko, draw Solar Recharge, Lila, Mill, Christia, activate Solar Recharge, draw Jane, Christia, Mill 2, Fairies. They definitely have too many Fairies in Grave. They have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 Fairies in Grave. So that Christia is beyond turned off right now. Uh, normal Summon Lila, Effect, pop the back row. It's Return, unfortunate. You know, if you chain it, these just get banished during end phase and we lose half our life points for no reason. Uh, they mill 2, Hamster, and an Arcus there. Pass, they draw Gores that we knew they were going to draw from Plague. And then Dark Greffer, attack over Lila. Pass, draw Celestia. Grab back JD off the second Gold Sark. Normal Summon Jane. Battle Phase, beat over for four. And then End Phase, Mill Plague. Pass, draw Wing Blast. Pass, draw Charge. Wow. Yeah, they're milling a lot. They only have seven cards. Activate Charge, Mill 3. Imagine instead of draw 3 Surge. Uh, go ahead, search out Raiko. Only three cards left in their deck right now. Summon Plague by putting back Christia. Tribute Summon for Celestia. Special Summon out JD. They're really hoping that this is going to like be enough. If it's not, then they JD mill four and they lose. Oh uh, yeah, Plague's banished. So, attack. Uh, take 18. Drop Gores. Yeah, beat over Gores, beat over Tokens, sure, end phase, mill the rest of your deck. Yeah, oh, I see what they, they don't know, wow, they actually don't know Light Sworn, because they went end phase, chain mill, pass, because they said, oh, I can't mill the top four, I don't have four cards, but this will still mill as much as possible, so they're going to admit defeat the there, and then on to the next game, uh, we're going to go ahead and see Light Sworn go first again, we got Treeborn Frog, Wing Blast, Mirror Force, Lay Imprisoning Mirror, Infernal Prodigy, they have Plague, MST, Solar Recharge, Lila, Christia, draw Raiko as the 6th card, Solar Recharge, Discard, draw Lila, Decree, Mill Orange Light, Soul Impurity, Set Raiko, Set Row Decree, Pass, draw Lure, then Activate Lure, draw Trap to Shoot, MST, Banish the only Dark in our hand. Now we're going to set 3 Pass, End Phase, Decree, and then they're going to go Raiko, Target, MST, Chain Light Imprisoning Mirror. They went, oh, I have Decree up. And we went, do you have a response? Chain MST onto Decree. Chain MST onto Light Imprisoning Mirror. And then they still mill three. They mill Lumina, Celestial there. They can trap Dust Shoot. Uh, go ahead, hit from their hand. They're going to hit the Christia. One, two, three fairies engraver. They have Plague, Lila, Honest. Hit the Christia. Okay. Summon Lila. Attack for 19, end phase mill 3, and then pass, uh, draw dark armed, definitely don't have anything for that, uh, set treeborn, which won't work with 
Okay, we're going to set both traps and the tree board. Interesting. I drill soul of purity and light. They're going to go Lila effect, target mirror force. That's going to get popped. Normal summon plague. Turn those into go yo. Then they're going to attack. Okay, take the tree born. Attack with 200. Really? We don't wing blast the go yo? It's so crazy. Draw a dark refer. I'm not like a super good Edison player or anything. And this player like won a YCS during Edison. So, you know, they've been playing it for a while. They're going to attack, attack, pass, draw Infernal Prodigy. Like, okay. Hole in the Wing Blast still seems so, still seems so weird to me. Dark Refer, discard, go dump, plague. And then we're going to go battle phase, attack in the Raikou. Okay. Oh my gosh, they sent it to Graveyard and said, hold on, never mind, let me drop Honest. So now it's like, wow, that's good. Now they have three Darks in Grave. Main Phase 2, Summon Dark Arm, The Dad, Banish Pop Goyo, Pop Raikou, Pop Treeborn, even Pop Raikou. I guess you just have to, they have Plague, gives them too many options. Uh, especially when we have, like, none. Uh, they draw Orange Light. And then they're going to summon out Soul Impurity. Uh, I have to banish two. And then normal summon Orange Light. Uh, turn those into Colossal Fighter. We got one Warrior in Graveyard. Uh, yep, one Warrior in Graveyard. Cool, so they can beat over. They'd actually get more damage if there was no Warriors. So that way they could uh, crash and then use its effect, bring itself back, and attack for 28. Or to be honest, they'd probably just bring back Goyo, because Goyo is nice. Pass, they draw Diva. They just instantly discard it to put back Colossal Fighter because, you know, they want to bring back Treeborn in the standby. Pass, draw Christia, that's definitely turned off. One, two, three, four, five in the grave. Um, imagine they just banished another fairy when they summoned out the Soul Impurity. Now, uh, pass, draw Diva, and then normal summon Diva, Diva effect, bring out Spine Gilman. But this isn't even that good, right? Like, we have Synchro 6. So we can make Goyo, we can make Synchro 5. Uh, we do get in pretty good damage though. Before going ahead and using all those to make Goyo, pass to draw Raikou. Okay, Raikou deals with Goyo, unless they want to solely recharge it away, which they do. Draw Christia, Hamster, Mill 2. Uh, so now they've gone through two Raikos, so they should still have a third for Hamster. Unless they only play two. Okay, normal summon, put back, bring out Plague. I guess that's fair. It can go into, like, a, a Brio. And Brio effect, out go yo. Okay, attack for 23, putting them on 300 life points. Pass. Oh, my God. They have Treeborn and Graven. They have top deck Monarch. Yeah, summon, tribute, bring out. Imagine if this was dark, though. So, yeah, they're going to go ahead and attack. They still have two turns, though, um, but they dropped down the... 28 so like any monsters game they draw christia that we already knew they were gonna draw but they can't summon it if they did the soul impurity correctly like they would have summoned christia before and the game would have already been over um but now they're gonna bring back treeborn during the standby phase attack one player is at 300 the other one's at 400 we set return which makes it so hard for the opponent to come back because a return on our follow-up play is like multiple plays because uh, we get to bring back four bodies, including a tuner, and then synchro with the plague to get access to another tuner being plague. They draw Thunder King, set it past, draw Miracle Fusion. Yeah, I mean, the Miracle Fusion's even turned on after it, too. Um, yeah, return, go ahead, bring back out Dark Greffer, plague, Infernal Prodigy, synchro, Miracle Fusion. But they said send PayPal. GG's, GG's. Wow! We actually just saw Light Sworn get four Odin matches. They just got destroyed, absolutely dog-watered on. Like, that was insane. I'm not even going to lie. Um, they just got outskilled, like, infinite times. Like, actually infinite times they just got outplayed. That was nice to watch. Um, yeah, I forget who this person is, but I'm pretty sure this is a person that... Or actually, I know that this is a person that won a, a YCS during, like, Edison format, or right around there. Or maybe I'm wrong. Maybe this was the person that won a YCS in Necros format. 
I'm not sure. But either way, uh, they win there with their hero diva deck uh, with some interesting choices in it. Like, I don't know if this stuff's standard or not, but, like, the Greffer, the Dark Arm, like, that stuff's cool. Um, playing Fossil Dyna, Penguin Soldier. Like, there's definitely some, like, not normal choices. You know, I mean, Dark Greffer, Dad, like, that's not too crazy. But Penguin Soldier, that card is crazy. Um, those four matches only took an hour and 20 minutes. And with all that being said, the DB Grinders signing off. Peace. Have a nice day. Stay safe.